up. It's your boy T Bird in reaction. So Martha finally keep keep continuing with trying to catch up on catch up and get caught with Call Season. We were on episode six. That last episode, episode five. Oh man. That thing was lovely. Especially at the ending part. My goodness. So anyway, what I thought you wanna check out episode six as well as a bonus um bonus uh music video from it as well too. So oh, let's get it. <laughs> it's crazy. This is uh Coco hey, man. Um, I, I need the almost over and I figured you might just want to spend the night maybe. You know, we gonna stand there evening. Um mm. that sounds great. But I really don't wanna move too fast. I mean we only been on like a couple of dates. I, f I feel you. I respect that. Damn. What's wrong with you? Oh, no, nah, it's just that I think I might have popped too fast. What do you mean popped? Oh, earlier in the bathroom, I took a Bluetooth thinking you might spend the night. A uh who? -huh. I popped a, a chewable thinking you might spend the night, and uh, I understand that you don't. I get it. Oh, uh, why you just didn't leave with that? I mean, I'm going to be in the room getting ready because hey. it's time to chew. Oh. Because I will be a freak until the day, <laughs> until the dawn. Hey. Hey. You saw that. Hey, uh, go to bluetooth.com and get your female supply. Just type in my promo code, Ja. You know the rest. <laughs> get involved, because I'm about to. Pew! Stay with me, stay with me, why don't you? Now see, Reese homegirl is keeping it real with her. Like, that's the kind of energy I need in my life. Keep it a buck with Feel me. Feel you on that, Nadia's a real one. But Reese needs to stop playing and finally give Bruce some buns. You know what I'm saying? You right. Mm -hmm. I know I'm right. Sometimes you just gotta give some buns up when the has been good and patient and respectful and all that. Okay, okay. I got a little experience with it. That's why. I, that's why I know. It wasn't one of his skits. A little bit. Okay. I, always call you on that. I, I guess you're right. Mm -hmm. Where you going? I need to start getting ready. Getting ready? We haven't even finished watching the Lesbian Homie. Lesbian Homie. Yep. I kind of finished this episode already. Wow, you watch the episodes without me, Shannon? Just this one, but I stopped. I've been waiting on you. Okay, I'm gonna finish watching them. I'm gonna catch up. You just don't watch no more episodes without me, cool? Okay, fine, I promise. All right, well, look, why don't you just call off today? You know, spend the rest of the day with me. I'm just thinking we can you know, bench watch the show, get something to eat, do some uh, bedroom yoga again. <laughs> Yeah. You like that yoga, huh? I do, I do. <laughs> Limber. Uh-huh. Look, as amazing, as amazing as that sounds, I can. I'm sorry, I got a bunch of errands to run today. You can't do errands tomorrow or another day? I wish I could, but I got to work the rest of the week. Yeah. So I got to wait a whole week just to see you again. Maybe not. I don't know. I'll try to move some things around, okay? I can't make no promises, though. All right. All right. Now, can I go to the bathroom? Yeah, you can go. Go ahead. Hey. Don't have that shower water too hot. <laughs> you gonna get in the shower? With I me? might come and join you. you know what I'm <laughs> Not too hot. You know what I'm saying? Anisha, what's up, baby? Looking good? I've been calling you. I know. Damn. You just not gonna talk to me no more? I hadn't planned on it. Mm. Well, what is it gonna take for us to be good again? Walk away. Come on, oh. Anisha. I made a mistake, all right? And I'm sorry for that. But that don't mean we should let that mess up our friendship. No, you let it mess up our friendship. I was genuinely trying to get to know you. I guess you showed me. Okay, look, just hear me out, all right? Like, I'm apologizing, baby. I'm, what, you want me to beg? You want me to get down on one knee? On both my knees? Because I do, what, what's up? I'm, I'm down on bended knees. <laughs> I'm not in a playful mood. 
Mm. I'm glad you right. Look, Abanisha, man, we've been friends for a while. We built a cool relationship. And shit, I've been jonesing over you for a minute. I mean, even when you curve me, it's always been a, a gracious curve. A gracious curve? Mm. You are so silly. <laughs> oh. <laughs> but for real, baby, in all seriousness, I apologize. You know, I, I should have been in more control of myself. Right. What's going to happen between him and the other girl? Was married, the uh, supposed married one. I understand if you don't ever want to talk to me again. You get on my nerves. I forgive you. But the next time I say I want to cuddle, that's all I want to do. Unless I say otherwise. Hey, look, I'm just a squirrel in your world trying to get a nut. Really? Oh my God. Was a bad choice of words. <laughs> so what's up? That mean I can I can call you? It's a free country, ain't it? You gonna answer though? I guess you gonna have to call and see. Oh, so you just gonna walk off like that, huh? That's how you gonna end it? Wow, that's that's crazy. <laughs> I'm gonna hit you though. <laughs> What's up, man? You just getting started? Getting started? I've been cutting hair since 6 this morning, youngster. Early bird get to work. <laughs> I hear you, Mr. Lou. Uh-huh. Mm-mm. Yeah. What, Mr. Lou? This whole aura about you is all off. What you talking about? She had a boyfriend, didn't she? What? What are you talking about, Mr. Lou? You know exactly who I'm talking about. I'm talking about that pretty young tall glass of water came in the other day. I mean, Tangelia, yeah, man, she had a dude, but she broke up with him. But did he break up with her? That don't even make sense. That's not how it works. What? It don't. You know what? Let me teach you a little something, young man. Ah, shit. Here we go. <laughs> Class is in session. Oh, here we go. See, you think breaking up is just as easy as we done. Bam, and that's it. I mean, that's usually how they work. What old school talking about, give on? Quiet, man. Don't you listen? <laughs> See, when two people have built any kind of love together, whether it's wonderful or toxic, the love has been already built. Now, the idea of letting the love like that just walk away, and see, that's kind of difficult. And see, your girl, Tangelia, she probably broke it off, but Malcolm didn't. Malcolm is still out there fighting for his girl. She worth fighting for to you? already fought Malcolm. Mm. Wasn't much of a fight. You know what I'm saying? Then my beep, bop, boom. Easy work. <laughs> All right. So y'all think breezy. But love don't quit that easy. Mm. That rhyme don't play a new game. Bars. Class dismissed. <laughs> Slipping. Third good. How you gonna finally cut my hair, bro? Dang, bro, you here early? You been here for what, two minutes? Trying to get a chili bowl? Oh, stop playing with me and you make sure your energy is in line before you try to line me up. Come on, bro. Come on. <sighs> Boop, pop, bing, pop, boom. Mr. Lil, what's going on? The hell you so happy for? Well, I can't be happy, man. Well, I'm all for happiness, but just be happy, young. Will do. Appreciate you. What's happening, man? Yo, yo. What's up, boy? Good, good. What's up with you, bro? Lady troubles. Oh, the Tangelia and Michael situation. Malcolm. Malcolm. What's up, man? You still fighting in the street? He ran up on me. So I mocked him. Mm. Third. Gotta remember, bro. Rule number five. Single women only, homie. I ain't know she had a dude. Yeah, but Mr. Luther damn near warned you the other day. Yeah, and that's why you got to do your research, bro, because that ain't never happened to me before. It ain't going to happen no more. Do it out the picture. 
He out the picture with you. Come on, very good, bro. Tell me you still not smash Tangelia. <sighs> Look, man, she broke up with him. She came back, man. Yeah, man, but the, the breakup is too fresh, man. Mm -hmm. Too close for comfort. You gotta let that go, homie. Like I said, man, I whooped his He ain't coming back. Oh, he for sure coming back. <laughs> what? Malcolm? Malcolm Jones? What, you know him? Eminem? He from my neighborhood. Wait, Eminem. Eminem, what's that, like a nickname or something? Yeah, he got a thousand nicknames. He earned them all, too. Malcolm Ali. Malcolm the Mopper. Mopper Bopper. You know? Lil Taz. Lil Taz. Yeah, yeah like Tasmanian Devil. <laughs> Dude been angry since the eighth grade. He ain't even graduate high school. Still walk the stage. Oh, he gonna have something for that. Anyways, I'm gonna figure out that situation. What's up with you coming in here like Jolly the Black Giant? Yeah, you was giggling when you walked in here. You know what I mean? Giffin and everything. Yeah, that's that jokes. Well, if y'all must know, um, last night me and Shannon had a little time. Mm -hmm. oh, man. Ooh, my boy put the extra slow cooks on for huh? I mean, you know how I do. <laughs> Yep. <coughs> finally. Yeah, finally, I know. But it was worth it. I wasn't sure that she made me wait the whole season. The cuddle guard is at it again. Wait. Hold on, D. The whole season? Yeah, G. Are you been using my clippers again? No, what were you talking about? No, I was gonna call you back, but you called me first. <laughs> what? How, how am I playing? No, tell me how I'm playing. No, I'm I'm on the phone now. Huh? You want me to come? I can come right now. No, no, I saw you calling, but I was in the middle of something. Yo, Vaughn. Uh-oh. Hey, uh, let me call you right back. All right. How you doing, brother? Hey, how you doing? I'm Henry. Sorry, we know each other? Ah, uh, you don't know me. You know my wife, though. Uh-oh. Shelly. Oh, shit. Hey, man, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't know she was married. Uh, she doesn't even wear a ring. If I would have known, I never would have gotten involved. I, I apologize. It's cool, man. It's cool. It's so cool. I'm going to need you to keep doing what you're doing. Sorry, doing what? Seeing my wife. Yeah, man. Nah, like, like I said, I'm, I'm at the pass. I'm so sorry for the inconvenience. Nah, man, I don't think you understand. I got a little situation on the side myself. Shelly's always in my shit. She's a lot less naggy when you around, all right? I need to keep doing what you're doing. Take her out, do whatever. I'll pay for it. Palm Springs, Honeymoon Suite, that's my favorite place anyways. <laughs> hey, look, man. <laughs> like I said, bro, I, I, I don't want no parts of this. Mm. Really sorry this happened. Pray for y'all. Brother, you don't have a choice. Oh. What is that supposed to mean? It means it's in your best interest to do what I say. Or what? 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 My bad brother you're getting a little hostile there, big man. Right. Hey, get the fuck up out of here if I can whoop your ass, bro. We'll see about that. Happy holidays. It's getting serious now. Oh shit. Oh man, it's getting serious. Girl, why are you trying to act hard like you don't want to see it? Why are you trying to act like you can't fit me in your schedule? Fake busy? First of all, I don't be fake busy. I be real busy, woman. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, if you're so busy, how come I don't hear no clippers right now? You ain't cutting no hair. Because I'm on break talking to you. I always call you on my breaks. Well, good barbers can't take no break. Oh, okay, somebody got jokes today. I'm just playing with you. Yeah, all right. What you got up for the rest of the day, though? Well, I just got off, but I got to be right back at 4 a.m. 
So I'm really gonna rest. And then, I don't know, maybe we can link up tomorrow when you get off? Yeah, let's do that. Matter of fact, you should just come straight over here after work. I have your bath water ready for you. Hey. Oh, not bath water? You speaking my language now? Wait a minute, let me find out. Go ahead and get you some rest tonight, and I'm gonna see you tomorrow night after work, all right? All right, I'll see you later. Bye. Excuse me. Uh-oh. Hey. Oh! Hi. Oh! Your name is Shannon, right? Uh-oh. Yeah, I'm Shannon. I'm Karina. Hi, Karina. Do we know each other? You work at the hospital? No, I don't. I don't mind waiting on you. Don't make me wait too long. You stay on top of my Oh, shit. She about to get She started to get real. Hold on. Shit starting to get real now. Oh man. First oh man, first uh uh Thorgood trying to get back with the guy trying to get Mr. Ray's other girl with the his home girl that um he messed up with trying to do more and then not doing the slow cooker. And then then comes to find out of the one he messed with, oh boy ain't gonna be over, ain't gonna be done with him. And now I forgot my man's name is. He he then homie here. I'm trying to figure. It out. I'm trying to get it on. Homie here got 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 some got situation going on himself. And then you know these two about to go at it. Oh no! The, you remember what happened last time? Remember remember why, why he uh, he like kind of like ghost blew her off just to, to to see her. But yeah. Oh man, it's getting wow. This shit got to get real. So anyway, let's check out a um a joint from Sean song Sean Cross is called Call Season Part Two. Let's get it. What's up, Shu? Coming in here like Jolly the Black Giant. Yeah, you was giggling when you walked in here. You <laughs> ain't skipping and everything. Yeah, that's stupid. All these niggas got jokes. Well, if y'all must know. Um, last night, me and Shannon had a little time. Shannon. Oh, man. Ooh, my boy put the extra slow cooks on for her, huh? Yeah, man, you know <laughs> I do. Yup. Yeah. 
Good drum right there. Other than that, though, can't wait to see what's going on happen next because she's like, they started getting real. But anyway, if you like my reaction, like, share, subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's your boy T-Bird signing off. One love.